Are you ready for another car ride? <clears throat> another pleasure drive as we go down the road of life. Today, we're going to expand on that car brain analogy and discuss the core four functions of the brain. At a previous video that we talked about it, and one of the issues I raised is that if you can name it, you can tame it. Because it's important to really know what the issues are, how the problem is defined to really be able to address it. Or, if you use a mechanics perspective, if you can identify it, you can fix it. So, one of the things we're going to look at is the functions of the car and our brain again, but we're going to expand it this time. So, if you remember, the steering is like our thoughts and directs where we're going. The tires give us movement in the car and that makes it go. And the gasoline is our emotions and give us power. So starting from there, we're going to expand that. So if you think of the tires, movement, that's body control. That really is how we define how we're going. And so body control, tires. Steering, thoughts. And that is how we direct our connections with the world. Emotions are the power. But now the fourth thing we're adding is transmission. How we transition that emotional power into making the car move. How we transition that engine power into where we steer to where we want to go. And so in our brain, the emotional center is the amygdala. And the thinking center is the cortex. And in between the two, just like a transmission waiting to be used, is the limbic system. And the limbic system is involved with a lot of memories and how long short-term memories and how we connect and learn language and words and so many other things. It really does take and develop in a way that allows us to really expand how we're using our emotional power into our steering and thoughtful skills. So, using the car analogy, now we have four aspects of it. We have the tires as a body, body control, movement. We have the steering as thoughts, direction, guidance, insight, interactions with the world. We have gasoline as power to make us move forward. Now we have the transmission. And that puts things together, how it transitions from one to another, and how we develop and grow and intertwine all those different aspects into a car of our life that we drive forward. Enjoy the ride and looking forward to talking to you soon.